Looking at the co-main event of the night, we have Carl Williams versus Justin Taffa. Justin obviously is coming in for his brother, Junior Taffa. <laughs> so they're kind of replacing each other in their fights. Carl Williams, 9-1. He's 5-0 in his last five. And he's coming off of that decision uh, victory over Chase Sherman. Fighting off against Justin Taffa, 7-3. He's coming off of a KO win over Austin Lane. Looking at the odds for this fight right now. We have Carl Williams at minus 172, open up at minus 250. Um, yeah, I think that I'm going to lean toward Justin Taffa in this matchup, actually. I mean, I I did not like what I saw uh, with Carl Williams in his last fight against Chase Sherman. I know that he won that fight. However, it just looked very concerning because it, when his takedowns were getting stuffed and it, it looked like he was also getting a little bit gassed, too, he just could not get his striking going right he's mainly uses his hands uh for his boxing but this guy just did not get his hands going he was also getting his legs chopped up by a guy like chase sherman i mean i feel like chase sherman is not as good a striker as justin taffa justin taffa is a good kickboxer one shot ko power has a variety of power shots he likes to throw the leg kick target the body i mean he also likes the counter as well I feel like Justin just has the game of, you know, he's, I don't think he's ever even been taken down the UFC, although, you know, he hasn't really, um, sp like stuffed too many takedowns, but is a hundred percent takedown defense, likes a sprawl and brawl. I feel like he has the exact game plan to beat a guy like Carl Williams. So Carl is a solid fighter. I mean, he's a solid wrestler, good entries and takedowns for heavyweight, good control. However, his striking is just average, maybe even below average. So I feel like Justin will stuff enough takedowns to get to a KO victory and just really KO this guy. So I think the pick here is going to be Taffa for me. Um, I think he's a solid dog play at plus 147. Even if you want to play him at the Justin Taffa by KO plus 185, that's not even that bad to me, in my opinion. Get some more juice on that, on that prop. So yeah, give me Justin Taffa here as a solid dog play.